Hello everyone, Coco Bruchens here. Uh, today we have, I believe, my fifth uh, episode of uh, the Penguin, Penguin Project series I have on my channel. Uh, today we have the 2011 um, Jemmy Dancing Bumble. It's the mini one with the hamster mech. Uh, this is the one with the crazy fast one, and it's actually pretty good. Um, it lights up, but it does not dance, and yeah. Uh, just to replace the gear on this guy, and yeah. So... I got it for a buck, which is a great deal. Too bad it's a bit, too bad it's broken. So let's start. All right, now it's time for my favorite part, uh, replacing the gear. So, uh, I'm just gonna remove the rubber band, or belt, and then you always gotta make sure that you take these off. No, I, ugh, these are so hard to take off sometimes. Alright, then this should come apart. Hopefully, um, maybe not, please. And yeah, you can tell this has a split gear because this little shaft piece right here pops out easily. And that should not be doing that, so it is slip gear. Ah, there they are. Now, uh, these are 2011 mechanisms. 2011, 2012, such... No, wait, sorry. Uh, this is a mech from 2000, uh, that was used since 2008. Um, it is a very fast mechanism. And I absolutely I love that. I, I really like um, uh, these fast hamster mechanisms. I really like them. I truly do. Uh... Yeah, so we're just gonna put the gear in. Yeah, I think it'll be fine. Great, brand new mine tooth. Oh, nice spin it. Okay, right there it is, just right there. Super small. All right, now it's time to put everything aside and I gotta put this thing in. So what I do is I just put the gear onto the table Put the little spindle with the little, um, I don't even know what this little white piece is. I call it like a pulley piece or something. I don't know. I'm, I'm not really sure. And then I just bang it down with the, with the, with the handle of a screwdriver and yeah, it's done. Oops, this gear just fell off. And then uh, usually what I do next is I will pretend to put it back in. And then what happens is that when I put it back in, this, uh, the little nine tooth gear would slip back on, up onto the little shaft on the little spindle piece and yeah it makes everything a bit easier so let me just see oh god just so much grease it's just like really disgusting i absolutely hate the feel of grease it's like yuck all right yeah it's on there touching the gears so i'm guessing this should be fine no Put the belt back on. Let's see if this thing works. Um, unfortunately, I don't know what happened, but this wasn't, it's not, it's not moving for some reason. I just tested it, it doesn't work. Like, the motor isn't stuck, so I don't even know what, here, let me just, give, give me a second. I'm just gonna see what happens if, I know this is really, this is a really bad idea, but I need to check. I think it's fried or something, I don't know. I can't figure out any other reasons why it would be like, um, in this... The motor feels okay, so it can't be the motor. No wires are off the board. The motor's okay, like I said. Um, so it has to be something up with the, um, cob or the IC in the middle of the board, so... 
I'm gonna test it with the LED to see if anything happens. If I if it does, I mean that's kind of sad. All right, uh, so I figured out what the problem was. Uh, the wire for the LED in the star was a bit too short and uh, yeah, I just made it a bit longer. So yeah, it does work way better now. So yeah, here it is, much better now. Yeah, so let's uh, replace that the tie. So let's grab it. I don't have a white one, unfortunately. So this is a uh, black one we'll have to do for now. Jeez. Oh, what the? Oh, oh. Wait. Okay. Just please. All right. Uh, that's, just, that's that's just great. Um. Let's go this way then. Right, use a tie in, just cut that access part off. Right, and here he is, fully finished. Uh, let's get the arms posed. We need to clean up now because this has been open for at least three days now, which is great. And yeah, yeah. So just need the brand new gear 
and the burning transistor on the board. And yeah, here it is, fully working or fully restored. He's very fast. Um, I do. This is why I really like these 2008, 2012 um, hamster mechanisms. They're just so fast, and I love fast items. There's our T button. The only thing I'm kind of sad about is it does not have its butt tag, but otherwise it's still pretty great. So yeah. One of the things is that I actually have um, a 2004 one, and I believe a 2007 generation model of, of Bumble. So now I have like three, which is kind of funny. But yeah. So I'm finished with this recording. Yeah, that's it. Uh, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next Repair Penguin video. Yeah.